Hello, this is Anthro Teacher, and I'm going to show you how to use my Intention Repeater Wave Converter to convert this royalty-free mountain picture and any picture or a PDF, whatever, into a WAV file, a um, 96 kilohertz mono WAV file. So we have this image here is a mountains.jpg, and what we're going to do is you're going to hold shift and right click it where your python file is shift right click open power shell window here and it will open something like this so what we're going to do is on the powershell type python type int and hit tab and it will fill in the rest for you then you want to hit enter Input file name is mountains.jpg. That's the name of your file. Output is mountains.wav. And let it run. I have it set to create a one minute WAV file, but the default that you're going to find is a 10 minute. I'm doing a one minute here uh, WAV file so it's faster running. It takes 10 times longer to create a 10 minute one, of course. So we'll let that, for demonstration purposes, I'm doing it quickly. So there it goes, it, and it gives us a status update. Uh, the file input was mountains.jpg, output is mountains.wav. Number of times the file was repeated was 19. So your, your image, your, your JPEG image was repeated in the audio file 19 times. And we wrote 11.52 million samples. Uh, those were audio samples. So if you if we play the WAV file, this is kind of what it sounds like. And while you're listening, you may get a feeling of uh, uh, the feeling of being there, the energy of the place. It's also very loud. It's 95% max volume, so you want to listen to it. I'm listening to it just here like on 8% uh, of my max volume. So I have it turned way down low so it doesn't blast my ears off. So, uh... So that's what that sounds like. The code looks like this. If you open the repeater in like Notepad++ is a good program you can search for. There are values you can set. Volume level here, I have it set to 95% of max volume. Uh, you can set it to 25% is good if you if you're like gonna if you want to make it so it'll still be kind of loud, but it won't be like blast your ears off. If you do 25%, if you're trying to produce it to a CD, if you want to take energy of, of a place and make make a produce an album with it, you want to use 44 100 hertz sampling rate, and then you want to convert it to stereo in like Audacity or something. Default duration, I here it's a minute, but the one you'll see will be 10 minutes default, uh, because some large files like uh, big PDFs that are 14 megabytes will only repeat like three times in a in a, uh, a 10 minute file. So one minute duration would not be long enough to, to contain the full big file of like a 15 megabyte uh, PDF or something. So this is just the introduction. I gave you an, uh, a, a, an introduction to the sound or what it sounds like. It sh you can play this through scalar technology, like if you have a bubble or something, or scalar technology, power wand, or whatever, that, that you has wires going to it. You can hook those to your headphone jack. You might want to use a 32 ohm resistor in series so you don't unintentionally short out your headphone jack. There's a chance of that happening, but putting a resistor in series should help uh, against that. But if you have like a Dragonfly Red or a, a nice DAC digital audio converter, uh, it doesn't usually need uh, the resistor. It plays straight through. It works really well. Uh, I use this to convert, you could convert like a picture of marijuana or something, and then listening to the audio file afterwards, you can sometimes get the feeling of being stoned on that. So 
or pic- or even sexual pictures, whatever, anything like that, you can convert them and feel the, the orgasmic energy too of that. So um, that's just about it. So hopefully this was helpful. It's how to convert a JPEG image into a WAV file that you can then uh, convert to MP3 or whatever. If you convert to MP3, do it variable bit rate and do the highest uh, bit rate you can. But variable usually is better quality than a constant bit rate. So... That was good. Uh, Hopefully this was helpful. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.